Dr. Michael Kralik here to answer another question associated with the UVC body light. Uh, the question that we've been asked is, does the UVC body light upon operation, upon its sanitizing process, does it generate ozone gas? So let's talk about that process and what occurs. Back in 1930, Chapman presented the oxygen ozone cycle, and it's now referred to as the Chapman cycle. Uh, in this particular case, he showed that at wavelengths less than 242 nanometers uh, in the UVC range, that the oxygen molecule plus the photon of light that's at 242 h nu will go to two oxygen atoms. And that these oxygen atoms then will react with an oxygen molecule to form ozone gas. So this is the generation of ozone gas. In the case of the UVC body light, the emitted uh, wavelength of light is 275 nanometers. 275 nanometers is greater than the 242 nanometer frequency or, or wavelength that's required to generate the uh, oxygen cycle to ozone. So that's, that's interesting. Uh, lights that are out on the market, other UVC lights, for instance, a mercury vapor lamp uh, is at 253 nanometers, 253.7 nanometers. So that's a mercury vapor lamp. It's also greater than 242, so it would not generate oxygen. However, the excimer system that's becoming more popular is at 222 nanometers. Uh, but it is less than 242. So it's down here in this range, 222 nanometers. So it actually will generate the ozone. Uh, what Chapman also uh, showed, and I'll change colors here, is that at any ultraviolet frequency that is less than 336 nanometers, so any, any wavelength less than 336 nanometers, uh, what occurs is that the ozone uh, undergoes photolysis and goes back to an oxygen atom plus the oxygen molecule. So all of these germicidal uh, light systems would generate oxygen from ozone, but the 222 excimer actually generates ozone. Our UVC body light does not. So it's sitting at 275 nanometers and there's no ozone generated by operation of this particular light. Hope that answers your question. If you have any others, please let us know. I'd be more than happy to try to answer them for you. Thank you very much. Thank you.